Hi there again, everybody. I'm Martin Tyler, and Alan Smith's with me for this championship game. Yeah, I'm Martin. Really pleased to be here. Blackpool. <laughs> He's looked the manager at what they need in the transfer market and he's decided that a strong central defender is what's required and here he is making his debut. Yeah, uh, they uh, conceded one or two sloppy goals, I thought, last season particularly. And uh, in an effort to stop that, he brings in this player who might just be able to plug some gaps. They're not always household names, the full-backs, but I think this player, obviously, has got the potential to be one. Yeah, we always talk about the attacking qualities of full-backs these days, but what I like about this lad is he's an out-and-out -out defender, hard to get past. This is the Blackpool team for this match. Well, we've gone with a 4-3-3 formation here for them. Is that the way you see it, Alan? Yeah, I mean, it can be adjusted. It could almost be a 4-5-1 if they decide to come over all defensive this team but uh, if they're on the front foot that three up front can cause the opposition back four some problems camera Sebastian Polter Diakite Mackey cross coming in now Goalkeeper can get the ball here for his goal kick. Some transfer news. There's been a lot of speculation about the future of Edinson Cavani. We can tell you about his immediate future. He has moved on to Borussia Dortmund. Yeah, they were determined in their pursuit and certainly willing to spend around. Well, the referee has blown for the free kick. I don't think he's going to produce the yellow card. for a throw. Oliver. It's very good skill, he's made the difference. He's got his shot off now. Big deflection by the defender there. The goal will stand. That earlier incident, the big deflection. Well, that's the life of a defender. You try and put your body in the way, but sometimes it ricochets off. Let's see the replay now. So the first goal, it's 1-0. scraps for the attackers to feed on from the goalkeeper that time hung on to the ball well Mackey well that's a good challenge between the two of them there being moved around nicely here with this passing game shots on here a decent effort just just off target yeah unlucky because uh, he got some power behind the ball just not the direction Camera. Here's Hoylet. And shoots! And over the bar it goes. Oliver. Diakite. The 
shots on. The real chance for an equaliser there. That's when the top strikers deliver. Now, he's not a bad player, but he's let himself down there. Cameron. Goal news involving Peterborough. It's a goal for Pete. Oh, free kick. Awarded by the referee. Got a corner now. Well, the corner put where the goalkeeper wanted it, really. That's not the best idea. Sandro. We well, could be in. Shots off. And that one's hit the crossbar on the way out. to indicate three added minutes. Now, Junior Hoylet. Oh, in goes the cross. And it's a, it's a crossbar. He's a great volley. Look at that. Still a chance in there off the goalkeeper. He might be through. And here's the shot. He's kept it out. Played into the middle. Strong, powerful clearance. So it's 1-0 here as the half-time whistle goes. We talk about defending as a team. They just haven't done that, and well, that's been... Shown. It is the goal-getting midfield player who's being substituted now. Well, he has put in a lot of effort and maybe was just tiring towards the last five minutes here, so no wonder his manager's taken him off. He's read that well in midfield to get them on the ball. it well now the shot what a brilliant goal we just feel sorry for the keeper really the way he's hit that to his right he's got no chance of getting a hand on it different angle on it here Just widen the margin here to 2 0. Sandra. He's got his shot off now. We can tell he knows the game. He had a six and shoots. Useful block in those circumstances. He's taken a touch there of the defender. It will be a corner. And Noah really snatched at the shot. And it's gone well wide. Well, that finish, it didn't do justice to the move as a whole. Really weak effort in the end. Well, we are talking about uh, quality, really. Over. And he could get away here. Shots on here. That is a fantastic goal. And there's no stopping that. As lasered into the top left hand corner. And we restart the game 2 1. Well, that is a cheap piece of play to give the ball away like that. Sebastian Polter. Junior Hoylet. 
Well, the ball's gone out for a goal kick. Now he's a bit disappointed. He's going to be taken off here. And the manager may be saving him for another day, but also allowing him to get the full appreciation from the fans. Well, he was enjoying it. I don't think he wanted to come off, but uh, he's a key part of this team. He's got to be protected. Very weak challenge. Comes out, shot off, and he knocks in the goal. To save her. Well, the defenders just stood rooted to the spot on the edge of the box, and what a poor one to concede. Play has stopped for a substitution. Change is going to be made. The central midfield player, who's had a good day, is going to be replaced for the closing minutes of the game. Yeah, this lad's got a confidence, sometimes cockiness about him. It's really commanding on his day, and this was certainly his day. It's time for a substitution for Queen's Park Rangers. Well, it was easy on the eye, but in the end, pretty easy to defend against. Austin. Shot on! A decent effort, just just off target. Yeah, unlucky because uh, he got some power behind the ball, just not the direction. It's going to be a substitution now for. the way to win the ball back could be offside and he's flagged offside Michael Boxall Queen's Park Rangers working hard to get the ball then well Let's have another look at that, because it was a very, very tight call. They were in otherwise. Well, when I saw it, first time of asking, I thought he was on, you know, but looking at the replay, what a good decision from the linesman that was. This is how they love to play on the break. And now the shot! Terrific stop! it's Wilson he's one possession Stephen Colker Sandra I don't know whether they'll be able to keep this up Alan but they've made a, a great start and they've still got the lead well, they've come out with that fierce determination that underdogs do have quite often determined not to ball and he's up for the header oh the bar's still shaking and he goes for goal with his head well he chanced his arm from that tight angle i think he was actually trying to catch the keeper off guard there by going for goal and it's finished now at 3-1 but well, with all the pre-season behind them and all the talk about this game great way to start English Football League Championship. Birmingham City, one. Brentford, one. Blackpool, three. Queen's Park Rangers, one. Bournemouth, one. Leeds United, one. Charlton Athletic, one. Nottingham Forest, one. Fulham, one. Bristol City, nil. Ipswich Town, one. Sheffield Wednesday, one.
Peterborough United, two. Bolton Wanderers, two. Reading, one. Brighton and Hove Albion, one. Watford, two. Burnley, one. Wigan Athletic, one. Blackburn Rovers, one. Wolverhampton Wanderers, one. Leicester City, three. Copper Europe, Barcelona 3, Liverpool 0. English League Cup, Barnet 1, Notts County 2, Birmingham City 1, Brighton and Hove Albion 2, Blackpool 3, Port Vale 3, Port Vale 1 4 3 on penalties, Brentford 3, Blackburn Rovers 2 after extra time, Cardiff City 2, Oldham Athletic 1 after extra time. Carlisle United, 1. Wickham Wanderers, 2. Chesterfield, 1. Crawley Town, 1. Chesterfield, 1, 4, 3 on penalties. Colchester United, 1. Walsall, 0. Crew Alexandra, 1. Leicester City, 2.
Hi there, everyone. Martin Tyler along with you today. Alan Smith's alongside me, and we've got a game from League Championship, Alan. Yeah, hi, Martin. I'm really delighted to be here. It's Burnley today against Blackpool. Quite a few changes for Burnley. Tom Heaton starts in goal. Matthew Lowton starts with Ben Mee in the full-back positions. Michael Kitely starts with George Boyd out wide. Sam Vokes is the lone striker today. Our man in charge for this game is Lucas Papwick. Burnley pressing on. He's got his shot off now. Over the top. Jones, Oliver, he's beaten his man, he's got room to hit this, and it's in the net for the goal. And that is not lucky by any means, he knew exactly where we wanted to hit that, and hit it with power. Well, I want to see this again, this goal. And that has opened the scoring, 1-0 here. Free has blown for the free kick. I don't think he's going to produce the yellow card. He can hit it here. Or oh, looking for that first time finish. And all the best strikers are uh, very adept at that kind of thing, and he's not bad, but this could be a chance. And shoots! It'll be a corner.
defend me. The break is definitely on. Chance from the pass. Great work by the goalkeeper. The ball is his and he's made sure he's protected it. Goal news from Leeds. It's a goal for Wigan Athletic. 22 minutes played. 1-1. Oh, interesting news again. Boyd! Oh, well, there was the opportunity to get them back on level terms. Well, I think he snatched at that a little bit. Just needed a cool ahead when it mattered. Wigan Athletic playing in front of Alan McAnally today. Just a quick line from him. I'm sorry I had to cut him short. A Wigan goal. The score is now 1-1. Try it, and it's a goal, and they are level. It is certainly the kind of match that we thought we were coming here to see. With the better team playing the better football. Yeah, and they've handled that expectation, haven't they, in terms of being strong favourites? So fair play to them for that. Very weak challenge. Space for the shot. Oh, what a tackle to break up the play. Good position, they've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous... It could be a chance! Struck the post here. The players are a bit unhappy about this, but we can see it again, whether it should have been offside or not. It was called offside. Well, who'd be a linesman, but this linesman, he's one of the best, and he gets it right here. possibility for a cross played into the middle and he claims the cross it was well it's nothing's ever straightforward for goalkeepers but he's uh, not been challenged well that is going to be the goalkeepers quite straightforwardly quite simply and he can pick the ball up wasteful pass unforced error really Oh, great work by the keeper. Well, here's a chance. Could get their noses in front from the corner. <laughs> Two moves around. The... It's a quick break. It's a neat pass. The shot's off. Goalkeeper can only parry it out. And now the shot. Well, everything to play for in the second half. We've reached half time at 1 1. Forty-five minutes still to go, second half underway. Oliver. Opportunity now! It's a goal and they're in front with that goal. And that's sheer class. 
just guiding it into the bottom right hand corner. Well, here's the goal again. Off we go again, 2 1. It goes out wide again. Here's Gray. No one could get there to reach the cross. And it's Wilson. Now they've won the ball back and trying to make something of it quickly. Substitute coming up for the away team. And as we thought, Burnley are going to make a change. Oliver. Can he do it? Wonderful save. Well, there. A goal up. Now they've got a corner here. Goes for it with a fist. And here's the shot, and he scores. And he was the calmest man in the stadium there to place it to the keeper's right. Just a reminder, 3-1 it is now, the scorer. Coming up on EA Sports in the Football League Championship, the fixture, it's Burnley facing Fulham away from home. Yeah, a lot of people have been talking about this one. Looking forward to it. We're going to get a substitution here from Burnley. To Jones. He can hit it here. Keeper might be needed. A well saved. And the decision is a corner here. Well, there's going to be an alteration now, and with the team trailing, you can understand why he's going to make it. He's got his fist to it. The away manager indicating he wants to make a substitution now. Cameron. The shot's off, and that's the third, the hat trick. It's a day he'll never forget. Well, there is a saying that uh, things come in threes. They've come in threes for him, a hat-trick. Not just three goals, but he's played really well. His overall game has been top class today. Well, it's going to be a substitution now. I don't think we expected this. Such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. Ben me. Burnley have to score and they have to score soon. It's time for the Alamo by the looks of it. They need a goal and they're piling everybody forward. A change coming up for Burnley, I think. And here comes the counter-attack. 
Cut up, and he scores spectacularly. No mercy here for the opposition. Another goal, and they will be hoping that there's no more to come. It's uh, one-sided beyond belief. Yeah, talk about hitting a man while he's down. And I think most of the players out there are trying to get on the score sheet now. Well, the game petering out a little bit now, with both sides settling for what's on the scoreline. Vast difference between the two teams. Well, the home team has been outplayed, and the home supporters have lost their will to support, I think. Well, haven't they just? You could hear a pin drop here. I've seen one or two heading for the exits. They're not impressed. Kitely. Not a good challenge by the defender. Another shot. Very good stop here. Goodness me, it's hit the post. Kitely. No one could get there to reach the cross. Substitution going on the field is number 18. And it's come to an end now as the referee blows the whistle for the last. He's beaten his man. English Football League Championship. Blackburn Rovers, 2. Cardiff City, 0. Bolton Wanderers, 0. Birmingham City, 1. Brentford, 0. Watford, 1. Bristol City, 1. Ipswich Town, 2. Burnley, 1. Blackpool, 5. Leeds United, 1. Wigan Athletic, 1. Leicester City, 2. Charlton Athletic, 1. Nottingham Forest, 1. Bournemouth, 2. Peterborough United, 2. Reading, 0. Preston North End, 1. Brighton and Hove Albion, 0. Queen's Park Rangers, 2. Fulham, 1. Sheffield Wednesday, 1. Wolverhampton Wanderers, 1.